I have to admit, I mean, I'm a little emotional right now. I really have to admit I'm really um, a little emotional right now because this latest episode of Pokemon Sun and Moon, wow, did it really bring strong emotions. It's probably the most depressing Pokemon episode I have ever watched in my life. And that's saying much because I watched just about every single season of Pokemon. And wow, this episode was so depressing. It was so heartfelt. Like, it really spoke right here, right here. It hit me right here of how emotional and how deep and how depressing this episode really was. Especially since Pokemon Sun and Moon is so childish, so upbeat, so lighthearted. Because it's set in Hawaii and, you know, sun and all this, you know, glamour and stuff like that. To get an episode like this was so left ball field. And yet, it really, really touched on so many things. And in the Pokemon universe, they really don't discuss... Um, spoiler alerts, guys, if you guys don't want to see this. So, spoiler alerts. But, um, it, in the Pokemon universe, they don't deal with Pokemon death. They don't deal with death a lot. Because it's a kid's show. And the Pokemon games... You know, they're more primarily for actually kids. Adults will, adults will, you know, they'll pick it up quick. But for kids, they won't pick it up as quickly as um, adults. Because in the games, they do talk about Pokemon deaths and stuff like that. Especially with Generation 1, Red, Blue, and Yellow. And actually Green, if if actually you play the Japanese version. So, um, But in the anime and stuff like that, in the TV show um, and in the video games, they don't talk about Pokemon deaths. So, they do talk about it, but in a very subtle way. But this episode was, like, not subtle at all. Like, they really hit it hard. And, um, the episode is about two two Pokemons that are best friends. Um, Scotland, he is, like, a dog-type Pokemon. And, and actually, Litten, which is one of the, which is one of the starters in the Aloha region. He... Or she, I don't really know what type of Pokemon it is, but it's um it's a it's a fire cat. And Skylin looks to be sick. So they take him to the Pokemon Center, but he's not really sick. In fact, he's actually dying. He's on his last few days. And the way the episode tackled that was like it was so beautiful and it was so like it was so Pokemon. But at the same time, it was so sad because you get to see this Pokemon losing its best friend. And anybody who has lost somebody, whether it's a pet or an actual person, they understand, like, they understand what that Pokemon was going through in its final moments. You know, losing its friend. You know, losing the other half of him. And um, the episode was just so depressing, but it was so beautiful at the same time. You know, to see the passing of the leaves. And the way they symbolize the passing of this Pokemon. And then, at the end of the episode, you know, where Lydon looks up and you see the cloud. And the cloud is shaped like his friend. It's shaped like Scotland. And, um, you know, it was so beautiful. And then finally, it went with Ash's groups. So Ash got a new Pokemon. But the way they dealt with it was so I won't say real because you know but um it was so well done it was so subtle and it's probably even though it's probably one of the most depressing episodes of this season of X Pokemon it's probably one of the most beautifully done episodes so far in the season um I honestly don't know what else to say guys the episode was just so depressing. Um, if anybody wants to watch it, it's uh, Pokemon Sun and Moon, episode 21. It is part of the one-hour special, so episode 20 and 21. But um, the episode that I'm discussing is actually episode 21, the second half of the one-hour special. So if so, um, if you guys want to check it out, you can. It's such a depressing, beautiful episode. But, um, you know, I think it's worth a watch. I think the way they handled Pokemon death in this episode was just... So beautiful, and it was so good. So once again, guys, um, what do you guys think? Did you guys see the episode? 
Um, did you guys get emotional singing the episode? You know, the episode brought me to tears almost because of how beautiful it was done. Um, uh, like, comment. I honestly don't know what to say. I'm a little emotional myself because the episode was so, it was so impactful. So, um, like, comment. Um, subscribe if you want to get more episodes. If if uh, you want to get more episodes, if if you guys want me to talk about more, you know, anime or stuff like that, just uh, drop it down on the the comment section. If you guys have any recommendations of what videos I should be doing, um, once again, put it down in the comment section. Um, I actually read the comments. I actually try to communicate with the people that actually watch my videos and stuff like that. So, um. You know, as always, guys, um, you know, have a beautiful day. You know, life is so precious. You know, try to enjoy it as best as, as best as we can. So be safe out there, guys. Have an awesome day.